morning children how are you all i hope all are well so children in the previous video we studied about addition theek hai okay and today we are going to start the new chapter that is subtraction that is subtraction on page number 57 page number 57 so in the brief i hope you have studied in the previous class also in ukg so let's revise the subtraction once again now tell me what is the meaning of subtraction see subtraction means when we remove or take away few things or numbers from a group we do subtraction in subtraction we count what is left the symbol of subtraction is minus this is the symbol of subtraction okay we call it as minus okay so i repeat once again subtraction means when we when we remove or take away from things or numbers few things or numbers from a group we do subtraction okay when we remove or take away few things or numbers from a group we do subtraction in subtraction we count what is left okay and the symbol of subtraction is minus this is the symbol of subtraction minus okay we call the symbol as minus now to make this topic more easier to understand let's see the example see here i have drawn five apples suppose you are having five apples okay and you are feeling so hungry and you have eaten two apples okay now tell me how many apples are left now count it 1 2 3 that means 5 minus 2 that means five apples are there and so that means you are having five apples and you have eaten two apple so in subtraction what we have to count in subtraction we count what is left so what is left here 1 2 3 so my 5 minus 2 3 that means you are having you you are having three apples now left okay i hope you would have understood now let's do the exercise on page number 57 so all of you take out your maths book and do the exercise with me first exercise is subtract by counting forward subtract by counting backward sorry subtract by counting backward okay so let's do the exercise see in your first exercise you have to count backward okay so let's do the exercise first one is 5 minus 3 so backward means you have to go back side that means you have to go back so before 5 what what is coming here before 5 before 5 4 then before 4 3 then before 3 2 that means 5 minus 3 we are getting here answer 2 okay like that you have to do the next one also 6 minus 4 then 6 before 6 5 then before 5 4 before 4 3 that means when we subtract from 6 when we subtract 4 from 6 so we are getting 2 okay now the 
third one seven minus three so do the exercise before seven six then before six five before five four so that means we are getting four then last one ten minus five before ten nine then before nine eight then before eight seven then six and five okay like that you have to do in your maths book now we will do the next exercise that is fill in the blanks okay so let's do the exercise so let's do the exercise second one fill in the blanks so in this what we have to do in this we have to do subtraction so 3 minus 2 3 minus 2 so first you have to do first you have to draw three lines then cut it cut two lines and how many lines are left here only one that means 3 minus 2 you are getting 1 so second one 4 minus 1 so first you draw four lines and cut one line how many lines left one two three so that means this is easy for you that means you are getting three third one seven minus three so draw seven lines one two three four five six seven and how many lines you have to cut three so one two three okay and how many lines are left one two three four so that means we are getting seven minus three answer is left four now in this d1 d four minus zero so you have to draw four lines and how many you have to minus zero that means you don't have to cut any lines okay so we here we are getting four only okay zero means zero so we are not cutting any lines next number e nine minus four nine minus four so how many lines you have to draw nine one two three four five six seven eight nine and how many lines you have to cut four one two three four then count how many lines are left one two three four five so that means nine minus four is equal to five next f eight minus seven first you have to draw the lines one two three four five six seven eight and seven lines you have to cut so one two three four five six seven how many lines are left only one so that means eight minus seven one one is left next last second last g you have to draw six line one two three four five six how many lines you have to cut in this two one two how many lefts one two three four so, 6 minus 2, we get the answer 4. Last one, 8 minus 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And how many, how many lines we have to cut? 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. How many lines are left? 1, 2, 3, 4. So, we are getting 4. Okay, like that you have to do in your maths book. And do the practice at home in your maths in your rough copy okay so that's all for today and in the next video we will discuss the next topic that is subtract subtract and answer and subtract using number line and fill in the boxes so all of you do practice and learn it Okay.